Hey everyone, I'm Mike Brooks. We're back in the Shape Your Future Healthy Kitchen with our good friend Chef Valerie from the OUTU School of Community Medicine. I had to practice this chili lime rainbow slaw. This is gorgeous. Oh, good. Thank this you. This is beautiful. It is a lot of words. It's also a lot of ingredients, but it's also really worth it. Okay. So what we're going to start with, a lot of these products are available at the farmer's market right now. Cabbages, mm -hmm. carrots, uh, root vegetables. And so what we have is red cabbage, green cabbage, red onion, white onion, green onion, and we also have some edamame, which is like a Ooh. green soybean. Okay. Okay, so these are, all, these are all shredded. I use my food processor. You could also use a box grater and just, you know, use your hands to grate. Mm -hmm. You could also use your knife and cutting board and just try to get some really thin slices of the cabbage, chop up the cilantro, chop the green onion. Don't feel like a food processor is gonna hold you up on this because okay. it doesn't really matter. Right. Um, and then the next thing is gonna be the dressing, okay? And so we mm -hmm. have some light mayonnaise, we have a little bit of yogurt. We're using a coconut yogurt, but you can use any kind of yogurt that you want. We are going to add some chili powder. This is a couple of tablespoons of chili powder. If you want less kick, add less chili powder. Mm -hmm. Okay, some cumin, that's about a tablespoon. We are also going to add some lime zest. So that is just the outside green skin of the lime. You don't want to get down into the white because that can get very bitter. Okay. But you can use your box grater for that. Um, we're gonna add some lime juice, so it's the zest and juice of one lime. We're gonna add about a tea, this is about two teaspoons of white sugar. You can use brown sugar, honey, agave, something mm -hmm. that has you know a little bit less processed. Um, I'm gonna add a quarter a teaspoon of ground black pepper and a quarter a teaspoon of kosher salt. That is just gonna get whisked or forked together to make how, a, how a nice dressing. Yeah, 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 that's right, any way you can mix it. <laughs> So once that is all nice and combined, this just gets poured on top of the, the vegetables, okay? And this is a slaw. It's gonna last for a week or so in your refrigerator. It's gonna continue to get better. Those flavors are gonna meld. It's super delicious. It makes a ton, too. It does, it makes a ton. So this yeah. is lunch, this is big family dinner. Mm -hmm. um, then the next thing that's gonna go in it is the shelled anabame. So you can get these in the freezer section, extremely affordable, a great protein source. And I'll just pick one out of here so you can see it again. Yeah if you can see that. And so that's what an edamame is, but it's a very good, like I said, a good protein source. What does it taste like? Is it good? I think they're good. They're sweet mm -hmm. and they're kind of nutty. Oh, it is, it's good. Yeah, Okay. Good. I wouldn't feed you something bad, <laughs> but I would choke you. That's okay. I tried to inhale right there. Uh-oh. Okay, so our finished product here is the chili lime rainbow slaw with a wonderful dressing on it. And then just, we did some uh, tofu earlier. So we seared that tofu off and it goes great with it. Look how gorgeous. You can impress everybody with this. Look at that. You're going to find our recipes on our website, kgrh.com. Thank you very much. Thank you.